We're here at the one-to-one -one oil and gas conference in London. Graham, can you give us an introduction to the company? Well, FAIR is an AIM-listed E&P company, full cycle, around £500 million market cap. Uh, we are an explorer um, by, if you like, background. Uh, we've drilled in the last 10 years 45 wells. 35% of them have come in as commercial successes. So this is what's allowed us to grow our reserve base. Uh, we're producing 12 to 14,000 barrels a day this year. And in the next four years, we'll treble that to over 35,000 barrels a day. That's all fully funded through, um, through, through the company itself. And, um, and we've got a very active exploration program ahead of us over the next, well, many years ahead. Just the next 12 months is gonna see us drill seven wells. Um, again, all fully funded. We're drilling two today, right now. Uh, so very exciting um, look ahead. It does sound like a very exciting, busy time for the company. Talk about the next stages of development and the timeline going forward. Well, we've got our own Brassa field that we discovered a couple of years ago in Norway. Uh, we have 50% of that. We operate it. Uh, we're taking that forward to development. We'll have a decision at the end of next year to proceed with that. And we have a number of other projects that we're pursuing. We're a discovery we announced earlier this year, biggest one we've ever made in Norway. Uh, we're appraising that early next year and expect to move towards a development decision uh, in the 12 to 18 months following that. So it's really big um, progress coming up over the next few months. So what took you to Norway? What's it like operating in that? Operating there? Uh, Norway's always been an attraction for me. Um, we've been there a long time now. This is our 12th year, so it's not like a new thing for us. Um, but they, the Norwegians have a very progressive um, approach to exploration. They encourage it through a tax rebate. So uh, for every dollar you spend in Norway, you get 78 cents back the following year. You can borrow the 78 cents from the banks. So that means you can drill a lot more wells in Norway than you might anywhere else for the same money. Uh, so that was an attraction, um, but the fact that it's under-drilled, so Norway is full of opportunity for growth through exploration, and that's what we're good at. And so we're there, we're making the most of it, um, and you know people want to work with us, uh, so we have strong partner groups. Uh, we just applied a couple of months ago in the latest round, um, and the maximum number of uh, applications we've ever put in. Uh, so it's all, it's all very attractive to being in Norway. So what's the key messages you're trying to get across to people at one to one? Um, I think it's growth, the growth opportunity that we present. Um, we have a very prudent approach to running the balance sheet, managing the balance sheet. So we saw our um, company uh, survive extremely well through the, the recent oil price crash. Um, many other companies suffered uh, significantly. We, we did not in the same way at all. We've never had any debt. Um, and I think so to see us as a, a, a successful explorer, one who, who really pushes hard in exploration but has a strong track record of success in exploration and adding value. Most of our reserves and resources are from exploration. Our production is growing as we invest in those discoveries that we've made um, and we're fully financed. So it's you know, an exciting company I think to invest in. Absolutely. And how has the one to one conference been so far for you? Uh, well, I haven't met any investors yet, so I'm hoping that we will at some point. Um, but yeah, it looks to be very well organised, well attended. Yeah, uh, I think tomorrow's going to be a very busy day for us. Well, thank you. Great to meet you. You too. Thank you.